Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I have just received Android Wear 2.2 update in my Asus Zenverse 3. In this video, I will tell you how to force update your Zenverse 3 to Android Wear 2. And I will also give you a brief introduction to Android Wear 2. To force update your Zenverse 3, you just need to go to the system updates and keep tapping the green screen on your watch as fast as possible. It will take about 100 taps to start it. The first time when the download screen comes, tap the right button and it will start downloading the update. But after some time, that is after getting about 15% of the update, the green screen will again come. Then you again have to repeat the steps and in turn, it will update you to about 40% from 15%, then to 80% and then finally to 100%. After downloading the update, just follow the steps and install it. It will take about 40 minutes to download and install it. So make sure that you have at least 80% of charge in your watch. You can see that I have finally updated my Zenverse 3 to Android Wear 2.0. Now it will prompt you to copy the accounts to your watch. So just follow the steps. You need to be connected to the internet to set up the watch for the first time. After starting, if you check the notifications, you will see that some of the basic applications are updating. In Android Wear 2, you will also get a notification bar similar to that in your smartphone. There are some minor changes in the settings too. Let's go to the system to check the updated versions. You can see that it has got Android Wear 2.2 and Android OS 7.1.1. Let's return back to the main screen. Press the side button to go to the menu. You can see that it has got the rounded design. Now the major change that took place in Android Wear 2 is that the Play Store is added on the watch itself, unlike Android Wear 1.5, in which you had to download everything on the phone, which then gets transferred to the watch through the Bluetooth, which consumes a lot of time. So you can now download apps directly to your watch as per the compatibility of the watch. You can see that I am now downloading the Uber. Let us check the other features. Okay. So if you tap and hold on the main screen, then you will be guided to an option list from which you can choose any apps whose information you want to be displayed in the main screen. So 
So the Uber is now finished installing and you can now use it without any smartphone. Another major update is the Google Assistant that gets embedded in your watch with Android Wear 2.0. You just have to hold the power button to activate it. So now you can ask anything and it will inform you instantly. From the main screen if you swipe to your left or right you can choose the watch faces and you can download more watch faces from the play store. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching my video. Please like and subscribe to my channel.